Hello everyone, I'm Nishi Jain and I'm presenting today Level 1, Project 1, Get Set, Go. So I will be sharing the journey of my life in bits and pieces with you guys. Being a happy child, a loved one of the family has its own perks. I mean, no complaints, no worries, love and more love. This is what comes to my mind when I think of my childhood. I mean, until quite later in life, when I got to know that my mom was quite under stress when I was about to be born, and she even cried when I was born. I mean, you guys must be wondering. I mean, seeing to me now, even that time, I must be a healthy child. But I was the second daughter of the family. And in those days, it was mandatory to have a son. The sooner, the better. Obviously, I was a little heartbroken. And for a while, I felt unwanted to. But surprisingly, it didn't last long. Why? Because I was surrounded with so much of affection and love everywhere that I could not doubt anyone. But still, I could completely understood this thing once I got married and I came to know how our society functions. So maybe the same way my mom was trying to accomplish something or she wanted to please her family. Anyways, saying with utter proud that today I am the most favorite child of my mom. Well, life moved on, got married from hardcore Punjab to hardcore Madhya Pradesh. Cultural shock. But once the things got acclimatized, I mean, everything was wonderful. Then I realized the power of adjustment. Even today, I pat my back for that. Then I got busy with raising kids and all. Then my husband got a very good business opportunity and we shifted to Ahmedabad some 20 years ago. Yes. I always wanted to do something of my own. But, you know, owing to uh, domestic responsibilities and some mental blocks, of course, I could not do anything. But uh, then came a financial crunch. There was a time and I resolved and I got up to support my husband and I took to teaching at home. And a new baby was born, Roots and Academy. So I had a sense of accomplishment. Then four years before, from now, my eldest son, who was working in Mumbai, he made an announcement that he was not going to do this nine to five corporate job. Again, a new dilemma. I offered to him that he should join me. He did. Together, we, take, we took Roots and Academy to a new level. And today, we are proud partners. What I enjoyed in this all was a sense of accommodation. I realized the power of accommodation. So life was going beautifully. I mean, never, never, never in my dreams. I was never aware that some big blow was, you know, coming to me. It was on its way to me. I mean, some six months back, I lost my husband to cardiac arrest. An utter shock. Even today, I'm struggling to get along with my life. I don't know what to accomplish with this unfortunate event. But I have always lived my life with these lines that wherever life plants you, bloom with grace. 
Thank you.